Welcome back. It's time now for Sunday Social, our favorite time of the week when we pick a post and share it with you. Sam, are you first? I, I, I don't know if I'm first or you're first, Max. Okay, I'm first. first. I'm up. Sorry about that. <laughs> Dropping the ball on the Super Bowl Sunday. Well, I got to share this with you guys. Uh, I was just on Twitter the other night, and this came up. Listen. I came to be on the stormy coast of Portland Sea. The winds blew hard and snow came down and storm says when we're done. Huh. Soon now the weathermen come, Todd and Keith gonna get it done. Just like a lion under the gun, so we on the run. Hey. <laughs> so two things. One, um, the Storm Center theme at the beginning. Yes. Very cool. Number two, apparently I had no idea there's something to do with sea chanties, like yes. chanties uh, like going viral or something. Yeah. And that's why they maybe did this. Can exactly. you explain? Exactly. Yeah. So I did a story this past week where basically this, the weather, the Wellerman, I think it's called, went viral on TikTok, but the shanty. And I found out that Maine has this unique history with its own sea shanties. So talk to the people. I think it was in like the Searsport area. Yep. Um, there's a whole collection of books there. Um, and then after they saw the story, they were like, we loved it. We created our own shanty. Unbelievable. I know. I so never fated. thought I would be in a, a sea shanty, but I am very grateful. Uh, that is one for the books, Ryan. And like I said, the Storm Center theme on the piano. Yeah. Pretty cool or whatever yeah. it was. No. Good stuff. Pretty, pretty cool. Yeah. And I am up, and I just realized I don't have the actual post in front of me, so I'm going to pull well, it up okay. here. Well, that's okay. I think it's a good one. I, <laughs> okay, I'm wait, sorry. maybe I can read it through. Okay, so I was um, obviously knowing that there was a storm coming, so Westbrook PD shared this, and I had to share it to my Facebook page. It says, if you rarely drive on snow, just pretend you're taking your grandma to church. There's a platter of biscuits and two gallons of sweet tea in glass jars in the back seat. <laughs> She's wearing a new dress and holding a crock pot full of gravy. <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's so perfect because I will say I drive, I always drive so slow in oh, the yeah. snow. And I'm sure I drive some people Ten and nuts. two. Exactly. White knuckling, exactly. me too. Exactly. Always better to be safe though. <sighs> Even in a place like Maine where we, you know, we're kind of used deal to with it. Snow. Yeah. yeah. All right. That's going to do it for us. Stick around. More news and weather after the break.